Hello viewers, this is Harold Linnea. Welcome back to my playthrough of Dragon Quest IV Chapters of the Chosen. In the previous video, we climbed the Great World Tree Yggdrasil, where we rescued Orophila and found the last piece of the Zenithian equipment, the Zenithian Sword. Now we're going to fly to the central island in the world. We're going here to search for the stairway to Zenithia. No matter where you try to land here, you'll always land on the western portion of the island. First we run into a couple of bull lions. So long, big kitties. And what's that big cave up there about? This town is the Azimuth. Behold, ye travelers of the goddess's earthly garden, stand humbled at the Azimuth gateway to Zenithia. Have you come here on a pilgrimage to the divine sky? Greetings and farewells, hope and despair, life and death, the goddess giveth and the goddess taketh away. Tread boldly, sheep of the almighty guardian, for thou art watched and thou shalt be provided for. This person here is the town priest. Your feet are blessed, for you stand at the azimuth the closest mortals can be to Zenithia. But beware, for Nadiria the underworld is not far distant either. That doesn't sound too pleasant. In the northwest of this very island is a cave so deep that it touches the abyss, a cave that no human may approach. Only Zenithians and monster kind may enter the cave. That is what the legend says. Wonder if we'll have to go down that charming place. There's a large collection of books on holy teaching, prophecy, and mythology. Check out these wardrobes now. Ooh, a mini medal. That brings us up to forty seven. Let's continue exploring the town. There is hearsay among us that Psaro the Manslayer has already unleashed the forbidden secret deep in his underground lair. The secret of evolution that was sealed away from the hands of mortals long, long ago. A terrible happening has taken place. Psaro the Manslayer, he who fraternizes with monster kind, has finally managed to perfect the secret of evolution. Why has this almighty calamity befallen us? Once the armlet of transmutation is employed, the secret of evolution shall still be more fearsome than it was before. The armlet of transmutation? Uh-oh. I know the truth about the man. Sorrow the Manslayer is a vessel of evil, his heart steeped in a curdled soup of hatred. He must be stopped, stopped before he evolves into a being more foul and full of evil than any who has ever cursed this world. 
Open your ears to the voice of the goddess as I have done. It was I who heard the goddess's all prophecy about the great hero who would strike down Estark. It is exactly as the prophecy foretold, that you would come here to the Azimuth, this too was revealed to me by the goddess. But now there is only silence. What will happen now that Estark is defeated is a mystery, even to me. Wise and all-powerful goddess, what does this mean? I guess it means that we will have to go down and take care of Psaro. And that pot contains another mini-metal. We're up to 48 now. Nothing in that pot. There are lots of dictionaries neatly lined up. Nothing else on that set of bookshelves. It must have been an act of the goddess. The person you see sleeping there fell out of the sky. Hmm. Hey, Arot, we have been awaiting you. You must meet with the Dragon God at once. Oh, really? The world is on the very brink of destruction. Will do. And what is here in the armor shop? Looks like some fairly decent equipment. I've got most of it though. But even if the stairway to Zenithia really does exist, it is not open to all. It is written in the ancient scriptures that only one with all of the legendary Zenithian equipment would be granted access. I have heard tell of a tower somewhere on this island that leads to Zenithia itself. And guess who's got all the Zenithian equipment? We do, we do. Beware the dangers of sorrow and grief. Those with heavy hearts are vessels of the wicked one. But all are born into this world blessed, blessed by the one true deity, the almighty goddess. Estark, born of the fiery flames of Nadiria, was struck down by a great hero, just as the prophecy foretold. But now he strives to be reborn, a new evil stirs within his condemned and tormented soul. Is that so? Well, we'd better take care of that. And what is available here in the item shop? Nothing of great importance. Let us leave town. Now we want to visit this shrine to the east. After we take care of a trio of ogres. fairly hard.
especially to my poor mages. ring. This accessory is like the happy hat. It will restore some of the wearer's MP with it every step. I think we'll actually give Carol's happy hat to Maya and put the goddess ring on Carol. Give Carol this iron helmet first. Then swap his happy hat for Maya's goddess ring. Kamikaze Bracer in the bag. Now let us go back upstairs. Back up to the top floor. getting that other treasure chest. First we want to take this elevator down to the bottom floor. As far as it will go down. Then we want to go back upstairs. All the way back up to the top again. Next we'll fall off this platform to the roof of the elevator, and then take this other set of stairs down. Now we can gra grab the Baron's Bugle from this treasure chest. This horn will be useful before the final battle because it will allow us to bring the wagon before us. Now to get out of here just drop into the elevator and take it back up to the top floor. Now we'll 
head back to the azimuth. But not before we run into a bull lion and a couple of juju gurus. Let's see what Baron's Bugle does at, in battle. Bang it up with the Magma Staff. I'll try to silence these gurus. Summons a herd of horses to trample the enemies. We left one guru unable to cast spells at least. That Kafrizzle could be a bit dangerous. Thank you, Bull Lion. Let's go, Boom, Maya. And those enemies have been defeated. Ragnar reaches level 27. Tornico reaches level 28. Check out their stats for a moment. Azimuth. Now we shall rest at the inn. Next episode, we are going to check out the stairway to Zenithia. And before checking out that place, make sure that you have all the Zenithian equipment on your hero. The sword, the armor, the shield, and the helm. This is Herald Linea. I would like to thank you for watching, and I will see you again next time.